Hey, what's up, guys? This is the Norwich HPA bottle gun, completely standalone with an actual HPA tank, so I can play with it today. The gameplay really will come out next Thursday, but in this video, I'm going to show you how I build it. I tried this before. It was this version right here with the bottle, the barrel, and the air pistol, but we needed a compressor for it, you know, those huge industrial ones. Of course, you can't play with it because it's 100 kilograms. So, today, we're gonna build it portable, therefore, I have this HPA tank. I um, have a line over there, then we will have an aiming device and a flashlight to build something like this, but obviously that's not going to work. We have to build a platform around it, which will be made from this piece of wood. To make this project happen, I need some base to build everything around. Therefore, I'm going to use this piece of wood. So let's just brainstorm. Here, here I want to have some curve for my shoulder. Obviously, this should be ergonomic. So this will build the stock. Then here is the grip. Here goes the trigger. Then we need the the shaft, like where the bottle is attached to. Then we'll make a foregrip. And, okay, a little wider foregrip maybe. Let's cut this out. Going hot. Super ergonomic. Now we have to make everything round that I don't cut my hands during playing. That's the base for the new bottle gun. Right now we have to modify the stock a little bit because it's offset. So I'm just gonna cut this grip right here. Now that works pretty well already. We are going to stabilize the whole thing. I prepared this spacer right here. Goes right there and. I also prepared the spare spacer so that the bear is always in the same spot that the BBs will always hit the same spot. So that's how it's going to look like in the end. So far so good. Now we also need the optic on top. Okay, and then the flashlight right here. Ah, my thumb is too short. Last but not least, I also need some sling. You know, if the gun gets too heavy, I need to rest it in the sling. So we're gonna make here in the back. Obviously, for the whole setup, I also need the backpack with the HPA tank. That one right here, I can just plug it into my new gun. All right, the Norwich bottle gun is ready. Have the HPA tank in the back, the modified line. Let's go hot. <laughs> Works. So quick rundown of the Norwich bottle blaster 24. We have here a very comfortable stock. Here with the roundness, you know, super ergonomic for your shoulder. We have two sling attachment points. You can either run a one point sling or a two point sling like I'm doing it. Then we have the almost 90 degree 
Foregrip made out of full metal, so no safe, no costs. We're safe right here. Nothing is plastic. Everything is either wood, metal, or PET, or the plastic barrel. Then we have the option for mounting optics on top. Optic is not included as always. And we have a technical foregrip. And of course, the mounting option for a laser module right here. You know, blend your enemies when you're entering the room with your bottle gun. Everybody will be blended anyways. But the beauty of this construction, but you can blend them additionally with the flashlight. Then we have a barrel spacer right here. So the BBs will always be on the same spot. You know, there's no vibrations or anything like this. And we have a 1000 round high cap magazine. We have the rattling issue, but maybe in the future I'm going to come out with some mid cap single stacked magazines. I can't wait to play with this thing. It's going to be so much fun. Bottle gun is ready for tomorrow. Gonna play with it. Super excited. Hope I'm gonna shoot a lot of guys. If you wanna see the video, you have to wait until this Thursday. If it's already released, you can click it right here. Ready for the first round with the bottle gun.